Hello. So I'm beginning to notice the enemy, his tactics. They're getting very old. Every time I testify of the goodness of God and um, he brings something else my way to try to maybe get me to stop serving God. But um, I think like Job, I can say, though he slay me, yet will I praise him, yet will I serve him, yet will I live for him. Because what I've found in all my testings, my trials, God has been constant, God has been faithful, God has been present. Like, I can't even begin to tell you how much God has shown up for me in all, in all of my trials, in all of my hardships. God has been there for me. I cannot credit it to anybody else. Yes, I've had sound advice. I've had hugs and I've had, I'm with you if you ever need me. But let me tell you, like having a constant help, like when I'm there in the middle of the night and I'm there with my thoughts and God is just there with me. And so the enemy feels like if I testify, he's going to bring something else and just he's going to probably cause me to stop serving God. But that's not going to happen because what he's actually showing me and what God is allowing me to see that he is the one constant, the one faithful, the one that I can literally lean on. I, I have found out in my hardest times yet because I know the enemy is not done. He is he's roaming about seeking whom he may devour. He's going to keep trying, you know, but... What I, what I found is that in all of my trials, you know, the one person, the one the one I could, could have really counted on is God. And yes, God placed some awesome people in my life and that gave me uh, the best, the best counsel, the best advice. And I am so thankful for God um, to, to bless me like that. You know, some people don't have uh, people in their lives to show up for them in the middle of the night you know I, I could have called people to be with me to support me and I am so grateful my family has been there in times of need but God let me tell you about my God <laughs> I will no matter what happens to me rain shine up down mountains valleys hardship tears like i go berserk go whatever whatever like 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 moses said god if you're not going with me i do not want to go and that is my honest my honest heart's cry because I have seen how detrimental things could be without God. I've seen even with God how hard it could be. And so imagine not having the, not having Jehovah Rapha, Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah, uh, uh, what's, what's, what's that one? Um, the God of Heaven's Army. I forgot what that one is called. But not having him to fight on your side. Could you imagine how hard struggles would be and trials would be? So... This is just to show, to, to let the devil know that I'm not going to stop testifying. I'm not, I don't care what you say, what you throw my way. I am going to speak of God's goodness. I don't care how low I might fall. I'm going to get back up. The Bible says a righteous man falls seven times, but you know what he does? He gets right back up. And so that's what I'm going to continue to do because God is faithful. He's faithful to lift us up out of the valley. He's faithful to lift us up out of of our downfall, out of our dumb decisions, things that we've done on our own to cause trouble in our own lives, you know. But let me just tell you, God is really good. And no matter what the enemy brings your way, don't let don't let the enemy distract you and, and like like he did with Eve in the garden. He caused Eve to doubt God's goodness. You know, that the, had her think that, you know, God is really withholding something that was good from her and so that what that's what he comes to tell you in your in your lowest moments like you know why would God have you go through this if he really loved you but don't let the the, the, the dark thoughts of the enemy uh, make you make you second guess the goodness of God God's character he's good by nature and everything he does is good it may be painful it may be hurtful but all things are working together for the good of those who love you and i can testify even in the painful season even in in in, in ah, 
hard wrecking, hard rending, the hardest season that anyone could go through, I can tell you, I can testify that God is good. He is, he is good. He is good. And, and he is working everything out for your good, no matter how hard it is. So don't you give up. Don't you give in. Just keep trusting in God. And let me tell you, he will come through for you. He will fight your battles and you will be, be victorious with God on your side. So be encouraged today and let not your hearts be troubled.